In this video, I will explain how crop recording of Dagon works. The program is very user-friendly and gives insight in everything that happens at the farm. Besides that, crop recording is necessary for certification. With the crop recording app, you can easily work together and register via the website or the mobile application. You can also manage your inventory in a simple way. After you made an account via the wizard, you can draw in your fields. There are two ways to do so. For fields in the Netherlands, you can use the magic wand. The reference layer of the cadaster will be used and you only have to select your field. In the future, we will expand this option to other countries. The second option is by drawing in your field using the draw tool. Using the draw tool is very easy. You click on the corners of your field and when you are done drawing, you double click on the last corner and press create. You give your field a name, you choose the crop, variety, the crop purpose, and if applicable, the consumer and contract. When you are finished, you click on save record. Before you are going to work with crop recording, it's recommended to configure the settings page of your farm. All of these items you can use for the recordings. These settings are also visible in the mobile applications. Therefore, keep them organized. When you go to contacts, you can see the contacts you work with on your farm. Your type of descriptions determines how many contacts you can add. Click on the plus sign to add a contact. Here you can fill in the information of the contact and determine the rights. This way you can choose to give a contact limited access. This is even possible per parcel or plan. You can now click on save and send. There will be sent an invitation by email. In this way, you can for example give an advisor the rights to only read and a fellow worker the rights to read and write, so that he can do the recordings. To organize the use of crop fields per year, you use a plan. The plan can automatically pass with the year end. In the new plan, you do the year closure of the previous plan and the stock will be transferred to the start of the next year automatically. In the recording screen, you set all your recordings. This will be synchronized automatically with the mobile application. Here you can see the map with all the fields. And here you can see the list with the recordings. If you want to add a filter, you can click on this icon. Now we are going to register a crop protection. Here you can see when the crop protection was applied, the duration, who executed the crop protection, and you can add a note. Here you can choose the method of crop protection. When you select a product, there will be a red or a green icon next to the product. The green icon means the dosage is approved. When there's a red icon, it means that the dosage is not approved. You do have to make sure that you've installed the admissions app. After, you click on Save Record and you can see the new recording. Besides making a recording, it is also possible to make a planning. This is very handy in case you want to make a planning for the next day or week. Click Planning and you will see the same screen as you saw at Registration. Here you can fill in the right data. For example, who is going to execute the planning, when, and you can add a note.
As soon as this data is saved, the executor will receive a notification that shows the new planning. As soon as the planning is executed, it becomes a recording. When you return to the dashboard, you see an overview of the plan, the farm with stock in the barn, and more. There is also a mobile app available for iOS and Android. In the mobile app, you can easily see the fields and execute the recordings. The mobile app synchronizes automatically with the web application. These are the basic options of crop recording of DACOM. For more information, you can visit our website www.dacom.nl.